All right, so how we doing, fam? Hope you're all staying safe. Welcome back to more Hogwarts Legacy. Gotta say, the support on this series... I mean, people are getting to my videos before I can, like, pin my own comment. That's, uh, that's a good sign. So, all right, love you all. If you want more of this series each day, just keep up on like support. Let's go ahead and get this. All right, here it goes. Equipping Who better gear for high... Okay. These places? Let me check my... Let's see what gear we got. I mean, I don't have a lot of stuff that's going to help me. Th okay. This is higher. We'll put it on, but I'm clearly going to change the appearance to be nothing. All right. I do have this. It's going to give me a little more, but I don't... Like, right now, I just don't have any things I actually want to have... I guess showing, you know? Like, this side seems fine. Okay, this has a slot, but I don't have any traits to put on it just yet, I don't think. Um, let me double check, though. Hey, where would you put that on? Let's see. Select. Change appearance. Hood on and off. Okay. Oh, that's cool. Yo, it's actually nice. I kind of like that. But I think this other one has better, better stats. Let's take a look. It's pretty cool. Change appearance. I think we're good on everything else for now. Um, this is about as good as my health, defense, and offense can get right now. Unless something's changed, but yeah, that should be good. Revelia. All right, so we built the bridge. We gotta go down that way, though. All right, here we go. One casual visitors down here. It feels like a dungeon. For oh, there's a spider right there. A dungeon for most games, where it's like you you go off the side map. I wonder if any of my spells will help me through this. I'd imagine we just kill it with fire, right? There we go. I might pop invis. Oh, that's. Huh. Level 9, too. Okay. <laughs> that's pretty cool. All right, nice. I accidentally misclicked right there. Rebellion. Man, this I, I feel like if you got arachnophobia, best of luck to you. This is a chest area. I don't have to come in here, but we will do it anyway. Yeah. That was sick. Yeah, fire does a lot to these spiders, which makes sense. The fact that they explode those is pretty wild. Like, I'm surprised that's in the game, you know? <laughs> All right, think we're good. Let's defeat spiders two out of 20. Oh, I guess there's different types of spiders to the game. All right, let's see what this is in this like, because I feel like it's gotta be decent, right? Okay. That seems like an upgrade. At least maybe. We'll see. Because I already have... I think my gloves right now are actually fine. This should be... Oh, it's a lot higher, too. So, here was the thing. I got these early on. Most... So, I'm guessing it's like a either a pre-order bonus or like from the Deluxe Edition. You get something like this early on, but the stats are always terrible. So... But you think it's rare when it really isn't. So, that was actually worth it. Right, I think we're good. Um... Change appearance. I like the ones that are... Sometimes the way it is is fine. Let 
I think we're good. That's a pretty cool little side section. It actually had some decent gear, too. Which I'm all for. Revenia. I see a spider in the... I thought I thought I saw one. I don't know. Was something back here? Hey, what is this room? Look at this. Uh-oh. This feels... That platform ought to be able to float straight to me. So it's gonna be like that game with the ball, right? Or maybe you do it. Okay. Why is it locking onto that one, though? It won't let me. There it goes. Now I can hop on it and then basically just go back. That is cool. Very nice puzzle. The auto lock changes. All right, we got a chest back here. We got. Not a headless skeleton in sight, but I may as well help myself to this. It's a better piece of gear. That's one aspect about this game uh, I haven't really talked much about, and that's the gear system. So far, it's really nice. All right, that is a lot higher. I kind of wish you could just default it to where everything looks like if you want to just have certain things a certain way. I think Assassin's Creed was a Valh Valhalla. Or Odyssey had a thing where you just... It automatically takes your helmet off or whatever. Or like your headpiece off. Destiny did the same thing. A lot of games have that. Oh boy. Alright, buddy. Kill him with fire. Moonstone. Alright. Okay, it says down. That actually is really cool. Spider thing. There's no sign of him. So the fact that it shows a down arrow is really nice. I think we got everything over here. Unless there's like a book around here. Hold on. Let me look. <laughs> it's like the ravens from God of War. I'm just looking around just in case. Sometimes you scan and they'll pop up. You can kind of see them though even before you scan I think. Get a chest over there. Alright, that was a cool little puzzle. That was a side area in here too. There we go. Incendio. Too far away. I'm gonna start bringing him close to me and then doing it. Man, that's sick. Another puzzle. Well, if Jack Thor could solve this, where's the other so one at? Perhaps the next symbol is hidden somewhere. Is it up top somewhere? Hold on. Rebellion. She said hidden, but I don't know if it's like behind a wall or... Oh, wait. Is that really it? There's no way. There's no way the game... There it goes. Okay, I was about to say... There it is. Let's get it. This is an aspect of the game that I'm actually surprised uh, it's really well done. Because I didn't know like how... Because it's not really a side thing. It's more of a... Uh, it's a main quest, but it's also probably something you can explore later on. Like, there'll be like a dungeon area you can go check out. Oh. <laughs> spiders, man. What was a game I played recently that like... if it, it had a bunch of spiders and it said... Like, if you're uneasy... I don't know what it was called. Evil West, I think it was. It had a warning for the spiders. Which I found pretty wild. Probably gonna miss a lot of stuff in here, but it is what it is. Yeah, this part of the game is really well done. Even though there's not like a lot going on, I'm just like having fun exploring. And getting the loot, which I'm all about that. Chapter wasn't very thorough in his search of this cave. This is like the addiction, you know? Like, I love loot-based stuff. 
And a loop based Harry Potter. Well, I keep calling it a Harry Potter game. You know why? When I. So. Whew, it's a uh -oh. good thing Jackdaw didn't fall down there. Why can't I select them? I guess they're just too far away. When I was making, like. I was getting, like, the first few videos ready. I do, like, research on, like, the key keywords and stuff like that. And, uh, one of the main things I saw was people were calling it Harry Potter's Legacy on Google. I thought that, and that was, like, a highly searched term. So that's why I sometimes get in the habit of saying that. All right, we got a few options. We can go left, right, or straight. I'm assuming okay. going straight is probably what they want you to do. We're gonna go to each side. This kind of reminds me of Batman. When he has, like, the grapple when he was in the water and he's, like, I guess, like, latching onto the side things. I'm glad Richard Jackdaw left a little something behind for me, but where could he be? We'll go across and then we'll go straight. Yes, yeah, is a lot of fun. Although I hate spiders, you know? It is what it is. Oh, I have to burn this first. It actually prevents you from getting up there without burning it. Interesting. You can't just, like, run through it. I just thought Jackdaw would have been interested in this one. There's no sign of him. Oh, you have to burn him. Okay. Or if you get next to it, okay. I think we just run through here, right? Rebellion. If you get close to them. Once they start doing that. Incendio. Look at that mist. It's a little too far away. That ain't good. Thornback spider. Slow motion must mean the last one. Okay. These enemies give a lot of XP, and we're getting materials too. Untouched Ooh, chest. chest piece. Chapter wasn't very thorough in his search of this cave. Yeah, that was also a side spot. Okay. Okay, let's see. Outfit. It's... Okay, it's eight higher total. With 16 up. Yeah, it looks good. Okay. I feel like this stuff you don't have to change too much with, like, transmog. What, the eyepiece? I think this was lower, yeah. We can dismantle those later on. I wonder if I can... I think it prevents you. I was going to use the other thing to, like, reconstruct, but I think that's only to put stuff back together. Haven't used that in a while. Some abilities, like, that's why I didn't know what to put on the quick commands just yet, because some stuff I feel is very important, other stuff not so much. All right, now we can go over here. Here we go. Gotta search it all. I may not do every side quest, but when we get to an area like this, best believe... Are you locking on? What's the point? Yeah, fire does a lot. Gives you a long time. A very long time to dodge, which I really like. Eight legs is simply too many. Something I haven't talked a lot about is the performance on PS5. I gotta admit, so games like Gotham Knights, Plague Tale, all that stuff runs like 30 to 40 FPS. Which is pretty low considering it's on like a next-gen console. So when I first saw this, I thought it may be a 30 FPS game, but I don't know yet. When I saw it like run a full 60 and it looks good, the resolution's fine. I was just kind of like, man, they did a great job with that. Is this another one of those side areas? Uh, we got... Man, you gotta go a long way with this one. Look at this. Will it, will it even... Oh, we gotta go side to side. Alright. 
There we go. Or we can stop it early and now go to this side. Man, this little dungeon is awesome. Probably just keep this in the middle, right? What we got here? Just money. Wait, is that it? Okay. I'm waiting at any minute to see some some Dark Souls fog for a boss. <laughs> That's what this feels like a little bit. All right, your gear slots are full. Increase. So you gotta do the Merlin trial challenges. Okay. I'm gonna. Okay, I'm gonna dismantle some stuff really quick because anything lower, there's no way I put it back on. Right? There's just no way. What would be full though? Like it's. There's only have okay twenty out of twenty. You can only have twenty pieces total. Here's what we'll do. We're gonna destroy this one. We'll just go through each column really quick. I'll destroy this. I'm gonna keep this other one because of the rarity. In case you can increase it later on. Get rid of that. Get rid of this. Uh, both of these are the same. Man, the sell value is the only thing I'm kind of thinking. Like, should I just not delete those? That's the only one of those I have. This I'm surprised that that's lower. Uh, sell value on like this one is nothing. So I'll get rid of that. All right, 14 out of 20. I think I'm good now. Let me get rid of this one. Or I, I'll just sell it. I feel like you don't get a lot of money in this game. At least right now you don't. All right, this might be a higher piece. And it is. Wait, is that like the max rarity again? Oh, it is. What in the world? Legendary. Now, I think it's the max. Okay, that's uh, <laughs> that's not that's not what I was thinking. Okay. I saw it on there, and it. I guess I didn't think it was covering everything. All right, we're good. We got the stats. That's all that matters. Inventory-wise, what is this icon? I was just telling you what, like, the new items I got. Spider fangs. Got a bunch of those now. Uh, collect this as well. We got a potion. Wait, we got more stuff to collect. Two potions. Yeah, what is this? More gold, okay. Man, we've gotten two legendary pieces in this area. Not legendary, but uh, we got one purple, one gold as far as I can remember. Uh, let's see. But we got some over there too. I'm guessing they want you to kind of do a drive-by. And like... Like, can you hop off like right here? Because you can't really... Okay, maybe I have to use this one. And you can almost make this. There we go. That was kind of hidden, wasn't it? I just thought Jack what? Would have Another one? In this loot. But there's no sign of him. Man, you gotta be kidding me. I keep getting upgrades. It's a... Okay. It's a small defense upgrade, but that was actually look kind of cool, but I'm not going to wear them. It would take away from the uh, the cutscenes, I feel like. Okay. Okay, we are good. Let me scan. Let me just make sure. We got everything over there. We got these chests. We got over there. We got that. I think that's literally everything. I don't know if I took fall damage or whatever there. Wait, wait. Okay, we're good. Let me hold on. See where I'm supposed to go. Tracking not available here. Never mind. I've been in this side area for so long. I actually forgot. I think back here. No, nothing. Okay. But this has to be it then, right? Because it shows the waypoint. Uh oh. This feels risky. There it is. The bridge. It's almost complete. More oh, spiders. These can't be what the head of the can You're a deadly great spider. That ain't good.
<laughs> That's like an instant takedown. All right, Chinese chomping cabbage. What? I guess I could use this. Okay, take some of these. Do a little bit of damage. All right, there's one. Hit another enemy with ex okay, spider explosion. What? Imagine how these spiders have multiplied since Dracula came this way. Rebellion. Mallow sweet leaves, alright. Oh, we got a chest down here. Let me go ahead and get this. Alright, so we have this I'm one. Glad Richard Jackdaw left a little something behind for me. Where could he be? All three, there we go. All right, find the missing pages. Here we go. Oh, this looks epic. Look at this. I must be getting closer to Jackdaw's remains. And those pages. That looks like some oh. serious enemies up there. Hold on. All right. Oh. That chest to the right. Hold on. Let me just loot everything. Meet again, Richard Jackdaw. Thank you for keeping these pages safe all these years. Okay, if we interact with that, something has to start. We gotta fight all these enemies, I'm guessing. So let me loot everything first. Something I'm worried about right now. Let me check my gear. Because I'm kind of thinking, like, if the gear can't drop, because I have 18 out of 20, I feel like I should delete at least one or two more things. Because let's say we complete this quest, right? And it will also drop gear, but it doesn't have... The space. Does it go to, like, a certain spot? I don't know. Here it goes. Here it is. The map that brought your doom, Jackdaw. Hmm. Is there something beyond this room? Uh-oh, here it goes. Be prepared. This should work on them, right? What? Okay. Okay, it locked on the one in the back for some reason. Disarm. What? That still hit me. No way. Yo, it does a lot of damage when it disarms. That's actually pretty wild. Okay. It's not gonna waste its ability on this single enemy here. Hold on. We got three more left, I'm guessing. There it goes. A boss fight. Let's go. <laughs> that was so sick. Yeah, too big to pick up. Okay. Fight this arm. Can't use that. It just kind of staggers him for a minute. But this works. Okay, that time it for some reason locked on to the other one the last second. Come on. Incendio. All right. Nice. First try. Let's get it. All right. Investigate the traces of ancient magic. Oh, wow. That's unnerving. What's happening? A little passageway. 
all signs are pointing to go there, so hold on. I've seen this before. In Gringotts and the restricted section. Alright, just like the prologue, actually. Where am I? The room is starting to flood. That ain't good. My end's gonna get extinguished. How am I being protected? What sort of magic is this? Oh, wow. Underwater now. Ooh, let's get it. This is so I cool. I really hope this magic protects me until I'm able to make my way out of here. Walking up to the surface. What is this nice. place? Ravenia. What? Can it be? It's you. Has someone finally found our map chamber? I recognize you from the pensives. You're Professor Rackham. I am indeed. I must confess that I am surprised to see someone so young standing before me. I'm the same age that you and Isadora Morganark were when you started at Hogwarts. You've paid attention. And might I presume you share our... Ability. To see traces of ancient magic? Yes, sir, I do. As you have likely realized by now, our ability gives us a unique relationship with all forms of magic. We can access expressions of magic that few others can. Opportunities will arise that allow you to sharpen this rare talent. Do not squander them. I won't, Professor. Thank you. We have much to discuss. But first, a map found in a certain book led you here. Place the book on the pedestal. I don't have the book with me, sir. Hmm. That is unfortunate. I'm afraid we must pause our conversation until you return with the book. All right, I'll bring the book here. Why is it called the Map Chamber? I'm a bit confused, sir. Why is this room called the Map Chamber? I assure you that all will be clear once the book has been placed on the pedestal. Are you a seer? Okay. The statues and carvings in the house on the cliffside, those are of you. Are you a seer? I am. Did you know that I would be here? I cannot say more at present, except to say that your presence here does not entirely surprise me. All right, let's get it. Very well. I'll retrieve the book right away. Good. We shall speak again once the book is in place. All right, your age. Okay, connection to ancient magic has unlocked talents. Plus one, okay. All right, the wizarding level, you get one talent point each time you increase it. Oh, man, this is awesome. Dark art, spells, core stealth, room of requirement, okay. Alright, we got five points. I feel like dark arts is the way. <laughs> uh, hold on. Level 22 on that. These right here, though. Hold on. Stunning curse. I keep thinking about the, uh, the Disturb song. Uh, Stupefy. Alright, let's see. Really? Take increased damage. Okay, Blood Curse. Uh, dealing damage to a cursed target inflicts damage to all cursed targets. Okay. What about spells? Hold on. Alright, Mastery. A ring of flame around you. That is sick. Alright, since I got five of these, I want to... Oh yeah, that right there is just... 
I feel like all three of these is worth it. You know? One there. Let's just get all three of these. I said I'll lock the next. Okay. Uh, rumor requirement. We got core. Let's see. Basic cast. Hold on. Basic cast impacts reduce spell cooldowns. That seems very strong. All right, holding down dodge allows you to... Oh my god, that makes combat so good. Vanish quickly to reappear nearby. That, I mean, that seems like a must almost. New spells been added, okay. Spell knowledge two. So we can carry more than just the four, okay. That's, now that right there seems like... You should probably get that early. Greater effect from healing. Now, that also seems good. All right, what's the other two? We got stealth, which, eh, you know. I don't think it's going to matter too much because I'm not really a stealth person. You can sprint while in it, though. That's pretty wild. Room of requirement. Hold on. All right, this pretty much just makes it to where... Okay. I think, honestly, I'm going to get two of these. Um, this one seems pretty awesome. So I'm going to get the dodge. We got one more point, and I'm thinking to have an extra column would be pretty good. All right. Talent points used. We're good to go. All right. Exit the chamber. So now I just, so I just, oh, I don't have any others selected. Well, let me put them on. I actually, I'll I'll do that later on. I found the pages and the map chamber. Why would I need the book? Off on another adventure, are we? All right, the map chamber. Uh, let's see. I guess I could just go ahead and let's just do this really quick. All right, so if I hold to a sign, what do I want to do here? This is like all offense. I might just use the other column as like these other things, like the disillusionment, putting things back together, you know, like the light, stuff like that. Um, all right, so right now, we so we can have up to four. You can have 16 spells at your disposal at any point. All right, right now, um, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to put these other ones... Like this stuff on here. Actually, I'll put that on top. This little square repair thing. Uh, and then, I mean, we don't really have another slot that needs anything. I think that's literally all I have. I can't do anything else. So, so at any point, I just want to just do that. That is cool. Lumos. That's pretty nice. I'm not going to lie. It's going to take some getting used to. But I'm glad that's a thing now. Because I was wondering why I can only hold four, you know? <laughs> so we have like a utility I'm column, I guess. Hogwarts. I wonder when Professor Fig will be back. I did promise him I wouldn't neglect my studies while he was away. Hmm. Suppose I have enough to distract myself with till he returns with the book. Here. Here. There it is. Oh, we love it. And we got a talent point? Let's get it. Rebellion. I mean, we might as well go ahead and use it. There was one other one I wanted to try. All right, so now we got the talents column unlocked. Make a lot of progress right now. Okay. I think it was under core. It was either this one or... You can have another section of them. That's actually pretty wild. I feel like that's a little much right now. I wonder why this is called two and this is one. Oh, I guess you're going up technically. So I chose the second one for some odd reason first. It doesn't really matter. I want to make the healing a little bit better. Because I don't really feel like health is that easy to come by in this game. Other than like the crafting, obviously. But we're not quite there yet. Uh, let me check my gear just to make sure. 
I need to go and sell some stuff. I know that was there. Let's see. What is this? What? Can't equip it. Okay. Unidentified back item. Superb. You can't even equip it. You can't do anything. Uh, I think we're good. Got some challenges. I can go select some stuff. I might clear out that later on. 